Mind if I record this interaction like you do? That's fine, mate. Okay, what's your name, please? So, my name's Sandy Constable Dominic Salvi from Mount Omni Police, registered number 26875. Yours, please? Constable Asia Sellers, Mount Omni Police, registered number 39932. Uh, my name is Ross Anthony Pittman. Mm -hmm. Or I should say Ross Anthony from the House of Pittman. Mate, I even go one better for you. There's my card. There you go. All right. If you want to make a complaint in the future, you can happy to make a complaint. You know Mate, to go. I can't see us going to the stage where it needs to be a complaint. Okay, I just want to know. Um, but ever, ever since 911 happened, I've probably collected enough of these to have myself a deck of cards. Are they giving you a requirement to provide your license details? Do you have a license on you? Um, Ross Pittman. Do you have a license on you, mate? Mate, you got the machine there. Can't you just bring it up? I need to see if I have a it's getting annoying. Can you hold that for me for a second, please? Thank you. It doesn't quite fit in my pocket, does it? Well, she wouldn't touch that. How do I know you don't have COVID? Come on, mate, take it. The absurdities of some interactions, shall we say. What seems to be the complaint? So the complaint is, is that you're actually here harassing um, Jess Pugh, asking her numerous questions. She advised you that she would uh, organise a meeting with you later on, away from this public area, okay, and you just kept asking her questions. Uh, she's a public figure in a public format, and I did inform her that if anyone came up and wanted to talk to them, I would gladly step to the side. I have it all on video if you'd like to see it. Well, your voice was raised also when you're in a public area. Well, I'm a little bit hard of hearing sometimes. Maybe I'm unaware that I'm you're raising my voice. Yeah. Well, you're not raised. I've been told that I have a voice that carries. Mm -hmm. Like some people have soft voices, and you have to go, What did you say? Well, I have that sort of voice you don't have to say that to. When you're asking a member of parliament questions and she stated to you that you, uh, she would make an appointment with you to speak to you on a later day. Uh, and then... It's on the video. I, I went to walk away twice and then she's kept the conversation going so I've come back. So I thought it was interactive myself. So were you parked, Did you, was your vehicle parked around the corner? No. No? Not in the direction you're pointing. So the vehicle's parked over there, is it? Not in the direction you're pointing. Where was your vehicle parked? I, mate, what, what difference does it make where my vehicle is parked? Okay. I'm going to cut to the chase. That I'm here. Right. At the moment, you created a public nuisance because we had a complaint. Right. I'm now giving the official move on direction. You are to move away from the area for 12 hours and not to return for 12 hours. Do you understand that? I love it. This is great. Not to return to this shopping centre, okay, for 12 hours. It's quite easy. I'll easily do that. Um, now is uh, 1607 on the 15th of the 10th, 2020. Can I have just five more minutes so as I can make a phone call to... You can make a phone call anywhere you like outside the shopping centre. Outside the shopping centre? So you're not going to come up to me there and tell me to move on again? I said outside the shopping centre. Shopping centre, all right. It's about the wording, that's all. Just getting the wording right. Okay. Outside the shopping centre. You are not to return to the shopping centre. It's all All right. It's the just like that shopping centre would extend out to the car park and the external fencing. The shopping centre, do you understand that? No, I was actually going to, just going to go outside the building. That's what I thought the shopping centre would have been property, concluded. Private property, you're supposed to be owner of the property, extends out to that. Well, what's your name, by the way, sorry? Senior Constable Van Barr is my name. Uh, number? Sorry? Number? Yeah, 1144. Okay. okay. So it's outside the fence? Correct, yes. All right, I'll do that. Public place, which is a good part. Okay. Do you understand the uh, direction it's been gone through today? Um, I can follow that direction. Do you understand it? I can follow that direction. Yes. I'm going to take that as you understand it. So you have to leave from your shopping centre and the outside boundaries. I can. Well, I'll go this way. Is that all right? Because apparently there's a big fence there with no gate in it. You can go anywhere you like, but outside the shopping centre. All right. Have a nice day. Fucking piss ants.